Well, let's head to Wellington where the backbencher pub, a stone's throw from the beehive directly across the road, really is famed for its display of satirical political puppets. And it's got quite a cross-party unveiling in store for punters tonight. Caricatures of Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern, Deputy Prime Minister Winston Peters. I can't believe they haven't had one of Winston before. They must have. Uh, Deputy Prime Minister Winston Peters, the National uh, MP Jerry Brownlee and former leader Bill English will be revealed. Our reporter Catherine Hutton is at the backbencher and beams in now by a live view. It sounds like it's going off. Catherine, what's happening? It is. It's, um, it's definitely a party atmosphere here tonight. You can probably see behind me the um, puppets are covered by, by sheets. Those will, the, the one behind me is Jacinda, Jacinda Ardern, the Prime Minister. She will be unveiling that in about 20 minutes' time. Now, this will be the first puppet of Jacinda. There will also be, over in the corner over there, um, a puppet of Winston Peters, and in the other corner, uh, Bill English and Jerry Brownlee. Now, uh, this is, as I said, Jacinda's first puppet, but it's actually Winston Peters' eighth, eighth puppet. Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> and um, I can tell... Sorry, someone's just walking around the camera. Um, it's a bit busy here. Uh, so he's, he's been portrayed, I can tell you, in, in the last uh, incarnations as an ageing prize fighter, a boxer in his own ring, a Machiavellian prince. He's walked the plank of Jenny Shipley's ship. He's cross-dressed with Helen Clark. He's appeared immaculately dressed in his suit, and he's, a, uh, he's been the captain of his own ship. So it will be very interesting to see tonight what he will actually, what his latest, latest scenario will put him at. Yeah. What, what, what about um, uh, Jacinda Ardern? What, what do we know about her puppet? Well, we don't actually know terribly much. Um, it was commissioned the day after she was made leader of the Labour Party, so she, actually before she was elected Prime Minister. Uh, so we're not quite sure how she's going to be portrayed. I spoke to the head of the backbencher pub. He reckons that the, the puppet of Jacinda is the best one he's seen so far. And he said he was simply blown away by it at, at 5.30 this morning. So it'll be interesting to see what it is. The but we have no idea. Yeah. There's no peaking allowed. Yes, no peaking allowed. Uh, 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 the other puppets are no. Bill English and Jerry Brownlee. There has to be one of Simon Bridges now. He's leader of the opposition, right? Yes, well, I, I asked our listener voice about that, actually. Now, uh, basically, his, his, his approach is wait and see. He said when Phil Goff was elected leader of the Labour Party, everyone said, oh, you're going to do a puppet of Phil Goff? And he said, no, because I don't think he's going to be there in three years' time. So he said the jury's still out on Simon Bridges, whether or not he will put one up, and he's going to wait and see. God, it's brutal. The back benches is brutal. How are the puppets made? They're made of, um, of latex, but it's a, it's a three-month process, and it starts actually with the cartoonist Murray, Murray Webb in, in Dunedin. He, draw, he draws a, a cartoon, and then they're made by a, um, a designer in Wellington uh, who is called Bryce Curtis. He's a film, film designer, and he apparently is very media shy. I won't talk to the media, but he, he produces all the puppets, and he's made all the puppets in this pub for the last 27 years that it's wow. been open. Uh, Catherine Hutton, thank you so much. Who's on camera, Catherine? Who's shooting you? Is it Bex? Sorry? Who's shooting? Is, who's, is it Richard on camera? It's Richard on camera, yes. Can you and ask, I'm having light shine in my eyes. Yeah, yeah. Can you ask Richard to do a swing around so we can see who's there? Yeah, do a swing around. We just want, we just okay, want to see... Just, can you do a swing around just to show the um, crowd in the pub, please? We just, we just want to see oh, yeah. who's he's a, just, just going to do that right now. Yeah, excellent. Thank you. Thanks, Catherine. Lovely to talk to you. Richard is just taking his yeah. camera off the stick. The sticks and the hole. Oh, here we go. Here we go. There they, which probably people don't necessarily want. There they are. Oh, it's mostly Jer mostly the, the August Fourth Estate waiting for the unveiling. Tony George. Tony George has been a cameraman since I was a boy. There's Hone Harawera, the puppet of. Uh, thank you so much, everyone. Beaming in live from the backbenches on Molesworth Street, when I was in the gallery, the greatest fish and chip shop in the history of the universe used to be roughly there. And I must say, I availed myself of it quite often on Molesworth Street.